Good afternoon, everybody. Rose Thorne here. So this particular react is going to be very, very brief. It's not going to be long at all. And it has to do with something that Pete said in his live, which is currently ongoing. So I found a twip. A twip? What's a twip? <laughs> I found a clip on Twitter of Pete saying that BBJ is hungry for her wet food and there's no wet food in the house. Now the replies to this particular clip on Twitter, people were saying that when Foodie Beauty was doing her errands this morning, that she was going to pick up food while she was out doing her BK run. And I guess she never picked it up uh, because Pete is doing his live and BBJ, who is the elderly cat, I believe BBJ is 19, 20 years old and they're out of wet food. And honestly, there's just no excuse for it because Foodie makes enough money to make sure that all her cats have proper supplies. And uh, apparently there aren't enough supplies for the cats. Uh, I don't know if BBJ uh, can eat dry food as well as wet food. And maybe that's why she prefers the wet food. I do know that Foodie was supposed to take BBJ back to the vet for some kind of oral surgery. That's what the vet said in the phone call that Roman played while he and Foodie were in the car. And I don't think Foodie ever took BBJ back for whatever oral surgery that BBJ needed. So BBJ is in need of oral surgery and she never got it. But let me go ahead and just play this brief clip on Twitter for all of you so that you guys can see what was played in the live. And again, it's not that long, it's like 20 seconds. She wants food, but uh, unfortunately, I think we're actually out of cat food. That's on Florida. So that was the clip, so. Chantal and Pete, they ordered food last night. Why didn't they order cat food through an app last night? She was there. She could have ordered cat food as easily as she ordered the takeout. Why didn't she order the wet food? And why is it that Pete cannot walk to a store or something and get a couple of cans and, you know, ask Foodie for the money back later? Or even call Chantal and say, can you order some cat food for the cats? I mean, she's spending time with Natter right now. Why didn't she take care of the cat's needs before she left? Why not do that? If you want to go spend time around Natter, make sure that your cats are taken care of while you're away. This is absolutely ridiculous. Foodie makes enough money. There's no reason why her cats should be out of food or any kind of supplies at all. It, getting cat food, cat litter, that sort of thing, it's, it, it doesn't take that much effort especially when these days all you have to do is just go to an app or go to a website, order it, and it's brought to, to your door that day or the next day. I'm absolutely appalled at this, absolutely appalled the fact that she's able to eat all kinds of takeout, so is Pete's, and yet these cats are going without their food. Like, I, I feel bad for the cats, I really do. This is This is making me really, really angry. I don't even make the money that Foodie makes and I make sure that my cat has what she needs. I have all the supplies. I keep food stocked up, all of it, cat litter, all of it. And if I can do it, then Foodie can do it. Okay, so I just want to show you guys this very brief clip. Like I said, the clip wasn't that long, but just when I heard about it through my comments on one of my videos, the first thing I thought was what? And I went to Twitter and I saw this clip. I'm like, oh, hell no. There's no excuse for this. She was out today. She was doing a BK run. She could have run by the pet store, got the supplies, ran back home, dropped them off, and then went on to Montreal, which is where she was at the BK. Uh, I saw a clip on Twitter that they were pretty much pinpointing her to be in the Montreal area. But she could have taken care of all of this before she left, either getting herself or having Pete go get it in some sort of way. There's no excuse for animals in the house to go with what they need. So that's the clip I want to show you guys. Please leave your comments below and please take care. Thank you and have a good day.